bitch. 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 Now wait a minute. Wait a minute. Bitch. Bitch. Is it on? Is it on? Now wait a minute. Bitch. This is your girl T.S. Madison, a.k.a. B.K.R., the BDB, and all that good stuff. And I'm coming to you loud, live, and in color from World of Wonder Studios. Welcome to this week's edition of Now Wait a Minute, Bitch. Ladies, I am dressed in all black today like the Omen. The only reason why you would be really dressed in all black is if you were at a funeral. But before I get down to really what went on at the funeral, honey, let me tell you something. The first person that you need to be real with in this life, in this entire life, is yourself. Because all of your deepest, darkest secrets will find you out in the end. Believe it, honey, believe it. Now let's get down to the story at hand. One of my good girlfriends and myself had knew a gentleman, honey, that we went to school with long time ago. So they had passed and went on to the neither world, honey, or, or the outer world, or whatever the place you go, honey, when you leave this lifestyle. But in this life, they were one of those people that had all of these terrible, lewd and lascivious things to say about gays. Now, a time or two, it was always on the tip of my tongue to read the eyes out of this complete bastard bitch. But I just held it in because I said, you know, one of these days he may change. <laughs> Get this story. Well, like I said earlier, the child had done passed on, had done went on to glory and whatnot, and we were at his funeral. I was looking good. My sister was looking good. We were dressed in all black, you know, black slims. Everybody was crying. The baby was crying. The mama was crying, the daddy was crying, the grandma was crying, everybody was just boo-hoo crying and carrying on, child. Even I decided to shed a tear, even though I didn't really care for that bitch like that. All of a sudden, honey, it was like lightning had struck the church, bitch, and the back door swung wide open, honey. Like God himself had walked to the back and pulled the doors open and let this child in. It was like a scene from the color purple. Everybody turned and looked like. And I saw the tallest, the highest, honey, the sight beyond sight of this wig sitting on top of this creature's head. And bitch, not just any queen, honey, she looked like Holiday Hard. Bitch, she looked like Wesley Snipes did when she played the role of Noxzema Jackson. Child, I'm not gonna bother to tell you, I thought it was Flip Wilson in the flesh. Child, she came storming in like the devil was chasing her. Screaming and crying and falling all out, rolling all up and down the aisles, child, honey, all the way until she got up to this child's casket, honey. And she put her hand on top of the casket and she said, he took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world. I was like, what? Everybody looked around like, what did this bitch just say? Oh my God, me and my friend looked at each other, honey, because we thought hell had done opened up child and let this thing up from the depths and come to this child's funeral. She stood up, honey, cause she was rolling all around on the floor, honey, like she was on fire. You know how when a bitch on fire, they stop, drop and roll. She rolled all over the floor, back and forth, back and forth, honey. And she grabbed the casket and she said, he took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world. He took a, he took a, he took a, like she had lost her breath. He took a, he, he took, he took, he took, he took, he took a good dick out of this world. I really wonder how good was the dick for her to be falling all out, gyrating, crying, snot running out her nose, bitch. I didn't know what the hell was going on. All I knew was he took a good dick out of this world. Bitch, when I tell you the pastor stopped preaching, the baby stopped crying, honey, the deacon stood up, the first ladies of the church held their mouth, honey, even the rest of the queens in the church clutched their pearls because nobody knew that that man in that casket, honey, was an undercover lover. Mm. Child, those words that that queen said will resonate in my soul forever. He took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world. He took a good dick out of this world.
the moral of the story is, honey, like I said in the beginning, if you're going to be real with anybody, be real with yourself. Because what you do in the dark will definitely surface itself to the light and tell you, now wait a minute, bitch. That ain't the lifestyle you was really living. Anyway, child, I'm on up out of here, honey. Because, bitch, if I stay here any longer, I'm going to read the eyes out of somebody. Always remember, bitches, read good books and bad people. Oh, <laughs> And remember, he took a good dick out of this world. Now, people, please remember to subscribe to Wow Presents. That's Wow Presents. Because if you don't, I promise you that I will read the eyes out of your head, bitch. Did you hear the news? RuPaul's DragCon is the first ever drag convention in history. Go to RuPaul'sDragCon.com for tickets and all the tea you need to know.